Well, this is Dean Phoenix with a very quick Final Fantasy X tip video, and this is a very useful trick where you can make just over 3.5 million gil, and you can see here that I'm starting with 1.3 million gil, and then 12 minutes later by the game clock, 57.36 there, we've got 3.5 million gil. How do you do it? Well, this is very easy. Uh, you catch one of every creature in Besaid, and there are only three creatures, Dingo, Condor, and the Waterflan, and then you take your reward, which is 99 Stamina Tonics, and you get that from the monster arena owner. Now after you've done that you travel to Killica and what we do is we buy some basic armors with HP plus 5% and then we customize the stamina tonics onto them. So first of all you want to sell as much armors and weapons as possible, everything that you don't want to keep. You just want to get rid of those. Now not only will this make you a little bit of money depending on what weapons and armor it is but it's mainly just clearing out the space so that you can buy lots and lots of armor. So you get 99 stamina tonics, you can use up to 99 of them to customise 99 pieces of armour. And what you do is you buy the tetra shields or whatever, it doesn't matter which it is, tetra shields, ring, any of those. Uh, just buy as many of those as will fit in your inventory. Uh, it's actually up to 99 but you don't really need to keep count uh, because you have a limited amount of inventory space anyway. Uh, but you just buy as many of these tetra armours as you can. After you've bought the Tetra Armors, what you do is you customise a plus 30% HP onto that armour by using the Stamina Tonics that you got for catching the uh, Besaid creatures. And you can see here I'm just using uh, R2 right trigger on PlayStation or uh, right trigger on the Xbox uh, to quickly move down the list and quickly customise HP plus 30% onto as many of those armours as you want. Now you may want to keep some of these stamina tonics uh, because they double your HP of all party members in battle so it can be useful um, but uh, unless you're doing a challenge playthrough they're not really necessary and they're not necessary for the Dark Aeons or anything like that. So do this with as many of them as you're comfortable even just doing it with 50 of them them or 30 of them will get you a massive profit and as you can see you put HP plus 5% which is already on there and add HP plus 30. Then you go through and sell these Tetra Shields and whereas they only cost us 2250 gil each they now sell for 28k. So you can see there very quickly uh, sell those for uh, 28k each and that makes you a massive amount of profit. Now it will actually uh, work out at about 2.5 million gil if you use all 99 stamina tonics and you can see there 3.5 million gil instead of 1.3 so enormous profit there and that's only uh, using about 84 of my stamina tonics I still had 15 left. You can also capture a one of each, uh, you can capture enough of each insect to unlock the arena creation for the insect and the reward for that uh, is 60 mana tonics and then you can do the exact same thing using those 60 mana tonics but doing it with MP plus 30. So you go to Killica, customise the armours uh, with MP plus 30 and sell all them as well for another cool 1.9 million gil. So I hope you found that useful. Please like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you very much.